today I'm going to show you how to connect for the first time your uh, Palulu servo controller. Um, the first thing you need to do is you need to install some software. Um, I'm going to include a link at the bottom of this uh, YouTube video. You'll see it to get to the site. It's uh, it's a little hard to find directly. You can go to their uh, you can go to their servo controllers and click through to find the user's guide, and then from there find the installation of software. But I'll have this link right here, so you can just copy and paste it. But then you go ahead and download it and install it. Follow the instructions that are uh, very clearly laid out here, and you should get a nice uh, flawless installation. Once you have it installed. Then what you want to do is you want to plug in your controller. Here I have a six-channel Palulu controller. Uh, I've plugged it into my USB port. And, of course, you can see it's powered and lit up. I have a servo, which is hooked up to it, which is hooked to channel zero. Um, and then, by the way, the channels, I, I don't want to flip. Well, maybe I'll show you another one. If you look in the bottom of the, well, let's flip this over. If you look at the bottom of the board, you can see the, the channels are labeled here. So you can see which one you're connected to. I've also connected it to a battery, which this is important. Don't ever uh, screw with this. Um, if you do, you'll be really bummed out. Make sure that the black wire of your servo um, or whatever it is you're connecting to it, your battery, is on the outer edge of the board. You want it all the black wires lined up along this edge. You want to make sure your signals are closest to the chip. And of course the battery is only two wires. It's going to connect to uh, the center pin and the black to the outer pin. So make sure that's connected. Uh, now what you do is you launch the software, and let me find it here, there we go, and it should pop up, yep, and sure enough, it's found the address of a, uh, of a controller, and I'm going to click this on, remember I have hooked to zero, and oh, what is this, okay, well, you're going to see it the first time you look it up. The default uh, is to have it auto-detect um, this baud rate. Uh, what I end up doing is just saying OK, and it'll make a connection. You can do it here as well. It was originally on detect baud rate. Now we have it on a fixed baud rate. And let's go back to status. Uh, I've got it enabled, and lo and behold, if I move this slider, my servo will move. Now, for the robotics that you're most likely going to be doing if you're looking at this website, you're going to need the servo to move a little further than just from there to there. Okay, That can be done by going to your channel settings and setting your min and your max. So I'm going to increase my max to say 2300 and I'm going to bring this down and actually we'll compare them just in a moment to see really what we've got. I'm going to apply these settings. I'm going to go back to the status here and enable it and take a look. See the servo is now all the way over here and all the way over there. It does a pretty wide rotation. Let's compare that to the default. I'm going to go back over here, and I'm going to bring those numbers back down to what they were. And bring them up. Something like that. That's a good one. Okay, apply that. Go to status, turn this on. And now you can see it's not traveling as far. Okay. And I'm going to go back. And we'll actually we'll put it on this maximum and then leave it. I'm going to go back over here and I'm going to increase that. And decrease that. Apply it. Come to status. And you can see that this is even moved. And now we can turn it on. And let's push it a little further. All right. So you see you increase the range of motion that you can 
do. So you have to have this all working before you can move over to anything, uh, any of the software that I've written. And uh, hopefully that will get you started nice and uh, flawlessly. So I'll see you on the next video.